Cooperation, and I think I will be at miss if I don't mention this. Yes. There is a bridge uh, still in Fortanayo connecting yes. to several schools in the area. Yes. And uh, we featured the, that bridge and the schools that are in that area. I think it is a risk to to, to the learners in those areas. Can I don't know we, whether can we the proper in, infrastructure in, in, in those in areas. Or, uh, that is Macharia. No, that is Macharia. But... I will take it up with the CS Macharia. I will also go there at my own time. I will take it up with CS Macharia and I want to give you my word that that bridge shall be sorted out. Waziri, in terms of budget, the issues, there they are going to be uh, major changes because this is something you are going to do countrywide. I don't know if you have factored in uh, the issue of budget and uh, how much... I don't know how many times I am going to tell you that as Magoha, son of Magoha, my glass is half full, it's not half empty. And therefore I strongly believe that when it comes to getting funds to ensure that our children don't, don't die like chicken the way they did, yeah. money will be made available. So I'm not worried at all. I, have you, is there an estimate of the number of uh, children you are going you are, to bring to the you are being, schools? You are being very unfair because I am not Jesus Christ. I think you let us do the job and, and report back to your own. You are there. Instead of uh, the pressures that are in school, yes. instead of investigation now and whether children are resuming school, money. By Thursday, I will get a full report. The proprietors are being investigated by various agencies. I want to assure you that by Monday, before Monday, we shall tell the public whether if the school is reopening, to what capacity. If it's not reopening, where we shall take all those children. But we want to be fair, because justice must also be seen to be fair. I think. Uh, I will answer one last question. Yeah, because the, the issue of uh, Lenana. So what are we, eh? Lenana High School. I, I don't know if the, the land will be subdivided to create room for a public school. My friend, there is only one government in this country. And that one government is led by Uhuru Mugai Kenyatta. So if the government wants to take what belongs to government to build a government school, is there any problem? Let us be serious here because that property is government property. So if, if government says, can we tweak a bit? and create a Lenana primary school there. Who, yeah, and it's within Lenana. Who are you to say no? Or is, are you saying there's another government? There was a final question from that guy and I go. Um, what you want to ask, yeah. what is the difference between... I can't hear you. Bongolulu, the school is just shut down and uh, the talent pressures school. There is no, the reason I've shut it down is because there is no difference. And any other school, any other school that is like that, the government will shut down and ensure that the children are given alternative schooling. That's it. So is there a possibility of shutting down right uh, to the precious talent school? You know, this guy doesn't understand English because I've just answered that due process must go through. Since children died there, the blood of innocent children died there. Why don't you want to give us two days to come out with a if I had wanted to say so without involving people to do investigation, I would have answered it earlier, isn't it? But I think it is better to allow due process. And I can assure you that whatever is going to be done is going to be done, first of all, in the interest of the children, then justice, and anything else after. Thank you very much, ladies and gentlemen.